everybody, my name is Oliver, and welcome back to yet another reaction. Man. Today, I'm reacting to the Digital Circus episode two. And if you have not been reading my community tabs, or if you're new to the channel, there's something that's been going on for a little while, and I'm not going to explain it here, as the explanation is already in the community tab. So this is the first video I've recorded in about almost three or so weeks. So if I sound a little tired or anything else, then that's because I am, and I'm recording some videos now late at night so expect my e to sound a little like this a little bit quiet and for there to be a shadow over my face because it's night time when i'm recording this and it's almost midnight when i'm recording this video but that aside we're going to go ahead again to the digital circus episode two in three two one shipping here we go I'm waiting for this one and turn it up quite a bit. I'll just lower it during my uh, editing. Welcome to the amazing digital circus! Pommy. 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 And she's like moving weirdly now. Or is she dreaming? What do you see? Oh yeah, she's definitely dreaming. The spiral of bits of insanity. Well, I guess we're not all cut out for it. I don't even remember her name, honestly. It's <laughs> such a jack thing to say. Over the course of this series, I'm going to remember their, all their names. It's just been a while since I watched the pilot. <laughs> Abstract. The A. Pomni, how'd you sleep? Are you still sleeping? I'll let you get back to it if you are. There she is. Hope you're doing all right. I know yesterday was a bit of a doozy. Oh, so it's literally the next day. Doozy. Oh, and don't worry about the whole abandoning me for the exit thing. It's perfectly understandable what you were going through at the time. And there's no hard feelings. <laughs> you're all good. <laughs> uh, well, She's still a little hurt by that. Had all that. Kane's got a new adventure today, and judging by what he's been teasing, it seems like it's gonna be a fun one. Teasing, <laughs> talking about the trailers. Today's adventure is Candy Carrier Chaos. That's right. The Candy Canyon Kingdom's been robbed of their most valuable resource, maple syrup. It's up to you to bring the rotten bandits who stole it to sweet, buttery justice. An entire kingdom of candy? Sounds sticky. Very sticky indeed. Sounds <laughs> Bubble, you can't say that. Mm, no. Silver White! I I'm testing out a new AI in this one. It should be 57 times more immersive. Ooh, a new AI. You don't want to mess with the new AI, do you? <laughs> uh, yeah, no. Was, was that check box always on Zoobal? Sounds fun. What do you think, Pomni? So, our entire existence here is just LARPing. Well... Why are you all just standing there? The, the, the canyon, Candy Canyon Kingdom needs you now! Kane. No thanks, I'm trying to quit. No thanks, I'm trying to quit. <laughs> Alright, Bubble just went off with the uh, keep out. Wait, what? It's like a royal visit up in here. Looking for anything out of place. So far, nothing. Wow, Kinger, check out this castle. It's the quality amazing. just dropped. They've even got little candy bugs here. It's 
Yeah, I did. It dropped a little bit. She broke her mask is broken again. You must be the brave knight sent to us by God to help us with our recent catastrophe. That's us, ma'am. Your kingdom's awesome. Okay, so oh, it stuck on the gear. So we have confirmation that Kane is basically God in this universe. Or rather in this whole VR digital thing. Aside from it being called the digital circus, I'm just gonna call it the digital thing because we don't know what it is truly outside of the actual circus grounds itself. So there is that. I like you already. Look, Palmy, we're already friends with the princess. I'm not a child, you don't have to hype me up. I assume you've been <laughs> informed of your mission. The bandits that robbed us use a modded syrup tanker, so we figured the best way to go head to head with them is to give you a war rig of your own. Ooh, violence. What time period is this supposed to be again? Here's the key back into the kingdom for when you've secured the goods. I trust you not to let it fall into the wrong hands. You can count on me, your highness. Oh, please. Call me Lou. <laughs> Will do, Lou. I call shotgun. Oh, oh God, is that the horn? Oh, that sucks. Gangle, you drive. Farewell, <laughs> good night. I have every faith in you. All right, we're off to an interesting start. I 100% thought somebody just got ran over. <laughs> gonna pull through if we get all this back to the village i'm sure she will this much syrup would save hundreds of people we won't know for sure until we get back to the village she's a fighter though she taught me everything i know all right so these bandits have a reason Oi! are these bandits other people bandits. or are they just ai i like sent someone after us syrup truck All right, Gangle. When we catch up to them, I'll jump over, crawl inside, and shoot them repeatedly until they're unrecognizable. He has a shotgun. I feel like that violates some kind of convention. You're violating my ears with your clapback. Get driving, driver. So, Pomni, I'm sure there's some way you could help out here. Maybe when we catch up to them, we could... Better be assertive. Like this. Hey! <laughs> Jax! Wait, they caught up to them so quickly. I gotta get something. Ooh, grabbing them. <laughs> you know, I swear there was some kind of bazooka back there. I was about to say he's gonna grab a bazooka. Trouble finding it. Pommy, take this! Here it is. All right, Pommy. You just stay like that, and I'll cross over. Are you kidding me? <laughs> nice going, Pommy. Now I have no bridge. Aha! Uh -huh. Gotcha! The arms are broken up. Uh oh, the syrup. This lot's trouble. Let's see how that rig does on those rocks around there. My arms aren't short enough to shift the gear. <laughs> Ooh, now we're cooking. Hey, ribbons, up and at him. I don't think we. Aren't you supposed to be submissive and agreeable? Move it. Submissive and agreeable. <laughs> Wait, was this the only thing not moving? <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, these fellas just don't know when to quit, do they? Hey, quit mucking about and get back up here! Oh yeah, right. Uh, everyone all right? Can you repeat the question? There are knives in all of them. Knives. Hey, Gangle. You should ram into them. What? You should not ram them! Promise still on board! Do it, it'll be epic. Why are there so many knives back here? Do it, or I'll tell Ragatha about the figurine thing. <laughs> figurine thing? Are you guys trying to be killed in? <laughs> These guys are whack jobs. Let's give him some of this. Oh, oh no that was ramming? close. Guess I have to tell Ragatha about the thing now. <laughs> oh, he's still up here. Guys! Bobby, take this! Uh, hey, Kinger, is that rope attached to anything? Uh, I don't know. Let me check. 
<laughs> um, Dragon the. <laughs> Is she gonna be okay? I blame you for this. <laughs> they glitched through the world. Ow. Oh, teapots. What's with the teapots? Or are they lamps? Magic lamps. Lads? Lord. Where the hell are they? A maze? Teapot maze? Also, I have soda here. So this is nothing out. Wait a second, are they in the... I think I know where they are. <laughs> Character creation, there it is. Starting to realize. It's got an angry face on. I think. Map. Why aren't you or any of your crew up here? I'm not sure. Be because we are not uh, NPCs. NPCs? What are you on about? Oh, he's becoming sentient. What are you people? What am I? Oh. Where's mom? Y you have a mom? Shouldn't she be here with everyone else? I can't even remember her face. Did she ever have a face? Was anything ever real? Okay, well, wait, don't, don't think about that. I, I think there must be a way to launch ourselves back up, right? I want you to tell me. Exactly what I am. He wants to know everything. Yep. Um, back at the chocolate pit. Yep. Oh, is everybody okay? No. Oh man, poor Pomni. I hope she's all right. Poor Pomni. How about poor us? We're one tanker away from being Augustus Gloop. <laughs> Oh, 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 what's that? Do my eyes deceive me? A delicious gift from within the kingdom gates? Don't mind if I do. Whoa, 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 buddy! You're not food, we're not candy, we're none of that! You don't want to eat us! Oh, you're not candy? How am I expected to eat something that's not made of candy? <laughs> oh. I'm sorry. Pardon me always seems to miss the big gloopy monsters. Who are you, anyway? I am the Fudge. I used to live within the kingdom walls, but I was banished by that rotten princess after I ate too many of the delicious town folk. Oh, they were so delicious. Sometimes I could- Why do I have a feeling Jax is gonna somehow get this guy into the kingdom and destroy everything on purpose just for his own enjoyment? That was very specific. But I have a feeling that's what Jax is going to do, because that appears to be his character, to be the 
chaotic neutral of the group. I can hear them calling to me. Oh, God. That just sounds like murder. Is it really murder if it's delicious? Answer me that. You make a great point. Uh, no, bad point. Why don't you leave this to me before I start thinking your hair looks like licorice? Jax! Oh, wow, it kind of does. Stop! Well, Mr. Fudge, you seem like an upstanding guy with real noble goals. Oh, I'm not. If you knew what I did in my free time, oh, you'd be sickened. <clears throat> As I was saying, <laughs> I happen to know a way into the kingdom walls. Yeah, that's exactly where he's going with this. Help us out in return. Hey, when did you... Shut up, Licorice Hair. Here, hide it with this. Oh, you must be some kind of master of unlocking things. Come to free me from my outdoor prison. That's me. All we need you to do is help us bring some dirty bandits to justice. I saw the Reaper wink at me. Wait, what just happened? Oh. So they never fell down, just Pomni and the other bandit. What are you attempting to do, Pomni? That's a truck. Uh, Want to try helping out at all? <laughs> or are you still? <laughs> you okay? No. You want to talk about it? What is there to talk about? I don't just want to leave here. Why not? I don't matter in the slightest. I'm nothing. My life, my memories, my friends. It's all fake. This may oh, seem there goes weird, my phone. But I think I know the feeling. Well, maybe not the exact feeling, but feeling like you're nothing is kind of normal. I mean, People even feel like Finally, just get it out. I came from, but you still care about your buddies up there, don't you? I'm sure they still care about you. What does it matter? What do we have when you people leave? We're just obstacles created to be defeated and forgotten. Well, you don't have to be. The circus, the, the place I'm from, well, I, I'm originally from somewhere else, but if it has to be my home, maybe it can be yours too. The people there are interesting, at the very least. Maybe you could be somebody real there. Why are you trying to cheer me up? How does this benefit you at all? I guess I just don't want you to feel like you're nothing. I don't want anybody to feel like that. But I'm not even a real person. Would I even belong? I'm sure you wouldn't belong any less than me. And I could use a friend. A friend? You're a strange little character. Suppose I could give it a try. All I ask is that we don't tell the lads about this. You're a couple of bright-eyed yobos. And I don't want to drag them down with me. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. What's your name, by the way? Gummy Goo. Wow, Gummy Goo. <laughs> just about as dumb as my name. What do you have in mind in terms of getting us out of here? Uh, I don't know. Maybe some kind of glitch with the truck's collisions. I'm not really sure how we could. The blocks. All right. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. If this doesn't work, we can try something else. You're the expert here. <laughs> I'm really not. But let's see how it goes. Yeah, there we go. I just realized this might be a little vile. Yeah, there we go. <laughs>
shooting them back to the surface. I wonder where they're gonna land. Or can they even make it? Say, this is a lot more anticlimactic than I was hoping it'd be. What were you hoping for? You know, like one big final battle, bloodshed, death, chaos, whatever. Are you sure they disappeared? It wasn't that they fell off or something? I, I can't say for sure, but uh, yes, definitely. It's not like the boss to vanish with a clown. Very unusual. Well, that's... Concerning? Well, if worst comes to worst, we could always ask Kane to find her. I'm more worried she's having another horrible experience. She still seems really upset about what happened yesterday. <laughs> I don't think she really likes me that much. It's a lot for anybody to go through. Don't take it too personally. I remember hey, Kinger's how right. for you to adjust. Oh, yeah. I'm surprised you remember that. Remember what? <laughs> Do you guys have a second truck that flies? Yeah. Uh, wait. No, we don't. No, not at all. Oh! <laughs> uh, Fudge Monster is dead. <laughs> Couldn't keep it in, could we? That just reminded me of the Ratchet movie. You don't want to know. Good to see you, lads. Why are there two bad guy trucks? This one's full of syrup, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. Suppose it is. Well, uh, you don't suppose my mates here could uh, take this one back to the village, could they? I guess. Since there's two of them, there'd be no real harm. I'm so unbelievably disappointed right now. <laughs> well, maybe there will be blood, death, and violence in the next adventure. Ha 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 ha, how wholesome. Uh oh, yeah. Uh, this is Gummy Goo. He's gonna come back to the circus with us. Oh, uh, is that allowed? His reality was kind of completely shattered. I feel like it was the least I could offer him, opposed to just leaving him behind. Hey, that's good of you, Pony. Uh, let's take this dumb truck to the dumb kingdom, I guess. Thanks to you brave knights, our kingdom will once again thrive. I'm sure it was no easy task. You have no idea. <laughs> Farewell, brave knights. Have fun executing that bandit fella. Yes, that is what we're doing. What the? Oh, hey. Hey, maybe I didn't leave the gate unlocked for nothing after all. Uh, what? I thought he was dead. You still did that? Okay, wait. Y you did what now? Well, love to help you again sometime. Bye! Okay, I thought Fudge Guy was dead. Little hard shelled hamburgers. So, this is the circus, huh? I gotta get used to this. Oh, looks like one of these guys made it through. Wait, what? Oh! I know you guys love your NPCs, but if I start losing track of who's a human and who's an NPC, who knows what could happen? <laughs> well, I'm gonna go drink water. It's been a while since I've done that. Sheesh. Oh yeah, I forgot she wasn't even there. Sorry about that, Pomni. At least you tried. You know, he might be back in a future adventure. I know Kane sometimes likes to reuse NPCs. Uh. Got everything ready. Hey, you at least want to join us for Kofmo's funeral? We like to have a little funeral service to remember the people who abstract. This one just got pushed around a bit with your arrival and everything. It's the least we can do to honor their memory. It's 
Sakafnov's so never coming back. Oh man, I always think I'm prepared for these things, but then you set up the picture and, well, I'm already breaking. Oh, okay, there's no talking here. A sad rendition of the outro of the last episode. Human hand? Where did Jax go? You know what's weird? If you've seen my reactions to the very first Hell of a Boss episode, like episode one, not even the pilot episode, because I never reacted to it. That ending part where you supposedly did the right thing and it ended up being flip-flopped because of the direction of everything else. My reaction to that was pretty much the same as nearly five years ago. <laughs> exactly the same, same way I reacted to it. But overall, I really enjoy that. I like the new characters and I hope Gumigoo, I think his name was, he comes back in a later episode because I like his character. And that he became self-aware. And hopefully he remembers what happened. At least that's what I'm hoping. But um, we had some character development this episode too. Between uh, Pomni and... I already forgot her name. It's gonna... It, uh, tr trust me. It's gonna take a while for it to stick. I have to watch these episodes a couple more times for the names to fully stick in my head. But... We got some more character development between them, and literally what I said earlier about Jax literally came into fruition. <laughs> I think I pretty much got his character completely understood by this point. At least when he disappears and he actually seems emotional. It seems like he doesn't care, but he cares on a deep level. He just doesn't want to show it and just being like this jackass version of himself. At least that's the way I see it. If you guys feel the same way, let me know in the comment section. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy today's or rather, by the time we're reacting to this tonight's reaction video. And I will see you all in the next reaction video. Bye.